Hi, I'm Monica Brown of YourHealthSource.org, and this is an example of one of our basic shares. So there's vegetables and there's fruit, and basically what I did, I just took it out of the box and laid it on the counter. What I would do with this particular box is I would take my lettuce, and most likely we would have someone in the home tear it up and rinse and spin it in a salad spinner, and then it would be ready for salad. Um, sometimes I'll keep it in a bowl with plastic wrap, sometimes I'll put it in a plastic bag with a paper towel or uh, maybe a cloth or something, but these two heads of lettuce will be great torn up and ready for salad and one I just put in a bag and wait maybe a couple days before we tear it up. The zucchini, again for my family I would need double that or triple maybe but if it were me I would probably just chop that and put um, onion with it so there's some onion over here and saute it with probably coconut oil in my pan but one way we love zucchini is to put it in rounds Toss it with some olive oil and some Italian spices, a little bit of cayenne, and we lay it across a baking sheet, pop it in the oven with some sprinkled cheese on top, let it broil, it's awesome. Cherry tomatoes would go with our salad, or sometimes we just eat those. This is your chard, not a big favorite of mine, but it's dark green, very good for you, so I just cut it real thin. You can cut it into ribbons, or you can just cut it and put it in with your salad. You won't even know it's there, but you're getting it. Avocados sit out at my house until they give to the touch, and then when they do, I put them in the refrigerator. And then I cut them, and there's a video that kind of shows you how I go about cutting them, but I never peel them. So avocados are great, very nourishing. The cabbage is one that a lot of people tend to put back, but it's like a number one uh, vegetable for fighting against cancer. So I would really, really work on um, eating cabbage. You can cook it. You can make a soup out of it. But I would probably shred it and mix in one of those salad dressings, zesty salad dressings, like an Asian one or something like that. And that would be that. Potatoes I cook with my onions, so I'll just chop them up with butter and onion. Broccoli, the same thing, just chop it off, cut it into pieces, put it away in the fridge in a plastic bag or a container, pull it out and stir fry it, okay? And then again, onions, here's blueberries, just eat those normal plums, I usually let them sit out, but if they start getting soft, then they go to the refrigerator and they last a few more days that way. And then grapes, of course, we just enjoy them like that, or sometimes we'll freeze them and have them for fun, frozen. So that's what I would do with this particular box. I hope that helps.